If you like this video, please press like and consider subscribing. Thank you. Toyota is collaborating with Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency, also known as JAXA, on a planned mission to land an astronaut on the moon, with the Autogen expected to develop a lunar rover specifically for that purpose. As a first step, JAXA and Toyota have reached agreement to further cooperate and accelerate their ongoing joint study of a manned pressurized rover that employs fuel cell electric vehicle technology. The pressurized rover would have total lunar surface cruising range of more than 10,000 kilometers before needing to recharge. It will be Toyota's first full-fledged entry into space exploration after the car maker co-developed a small robot that was sent to the International Space Station in 2013. The robot, Kirobo, became the first robot to speak in the outer space. Japan only recently announced the lunar plans, and although they lacked the necessary technology and rockets to commit to a manned lunar mission, JAXA, or Japanese Space Agency, is already working on few ideas. One way of ensuring they meet manned lunar targets is perhaps hitching a ride on SpaceX or Blue Origin, who are developing rockets capable of manned mission to the lunar surface. JAXA has initiated human lunar systems, conceptual system study on a future human lunar outpost, but has not yet developed its own manned spacecraft and is not currently developing one, at least not officially. Although theoretically, Japanese space agency could use H2B expandable launch system to deploy small to medium sized rovers and medium sized satellites into geostationary orbit. The rocket sadly isn't capable of large payloads necessary for manned mission to lunar surface. A cooperation with European Space Agency, NASA, SpaceX and Blue Origin would seem to be the only way for Japan at this point to fulfill its lunar vision by 2029. This however does not stop Japan from joining European Space Agency's Moon Village or utilize SpaceX to deploy all the necessary technology to develop Japanese base on the Moon. However, going it alone in developing necessary tools seem to be counterproductive considering the alternatives are somewhat cheaper and will soon become readily available. It would be smart for JAXA to consider alternatives before investing in its own lunar delivery system, as working with ESA, NASA and SpaceX could bear better results, and Toyota Lunar Rover could be JAXA's contribution to the common endeavour.